future forecast showing you overnight tonight. We'll continue with these on and off again rain showers. That heavy rain will be out of here probably uh, within the next hour or so out over the lake. But we could see some sleet mixing in overnight as temperatures are flirting with that freezing mark. And yes, tomorrow morning between 7 and 9 o'clock or so, you will see some snowflakes, maybe, maybe a dusting on some lawns, but that is it, and it'll quickly melt. Then by afternoon, we'll clear out a little bit before a little lake effect tries to develop. Literally, it, this kind of expands it a little bit, but it could be right along the lake with that northeast wind. It's going to be windy tomorrow, 15 to 30 miles per hour. Looking for just a very light rain to the north, about a quarter to a third of an inch south of Milwaukee and about two tenths of an inch here locally. By morning, this is why we're thinking we're going to see some flurries and sleet right around the freezing mark in Hartford and West Bend and Waukesha 35 and Racine and right here in Milwaukee as well. Tomorrow afternoon, some sunshine and then some clouds along the lake that will give you a few flurries and snow showers there. Otherwise, windy and chilly, upper 30s to lower 40s for your high temperature. It was just in the 60s a couple of days ago. 43 for tomorrow, 39 on Sunday after a morning low of 20. Burr. Uh, at least the wind will die down a little bit on Sunday. Then we're right back into the 50s. Of course, we head back to work and school. 50 on Monday. Uh, some sprinkles and breezy on 53 on Tuesday. And the best chance of rain Wednesday night into Thursday. And uh, you were mentioning earlier, you like that even the low temperatures are above freezing, above freezing. after Sunday morning's cold. Well, that's okay. We like this weather. It's getting better and better. It is getting every better. Every day.